Oh, look at that. Yeah. Nice. That's what you should do. But as far as those turns go, you get used to using, practicing, and then someday. <laughs> Eventually. Yeah. <laughs> you gotta be able to do it in the walk first. Eventually. <laughs> Uh huh. Yeah. Yeah. Man, you guys get so fried. I can see how your little brainies just go. Oh, it's right. working. No wonder. I mean, you think it's working. <laughs> Nice. If you can get her to shift, great. If you can't, just do a little bull okay? Okay. Like circle, you know? And then change direction a lot. Because that turn, as you, as you come out of it, and then you turn, and then they'll want to reach. And she's done a pretty good job of that. Yeah, she's got a little Okay, so you get that inside rain, outside leg. Outside rain, inside leg. Look at that. <laughs> getting the right idea. But we'll kind of stop her. Oops. Oh, there goes that stand again. <laughs> Okay. And uh, when they, the idea is when they compress and then you give them a chance to stretch, they'll take it. Okay. And usually, I mean, she's finally getting to the point like a normal, or a normal horse should start at. Because <laughs> usually you don't have to do the side ring stuff. You can just compress it if they want to stretch. Uh huh. This one, she's already born to be compressed. So it's not a problem. <laughs> so. Well, so we took a little detour. Yeah. Uh-huh. Push off a little better. But I like these. I mean, this is good right here. See, I mean, she's not... And then she wants to shut down, so we'll go back to... <laughs> that. I was going to say, she was doing pretty good stretching at the end in there at the same time. 